Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be making a super creamy and refreshing agua de melon. So if you're ready, let's get started. All right guys, so first we're going to begin by prepping our melons. So we're going to be using two, and when you pick them, make sure that they are not green, that they are nice and ripe. Okay, so we're going to begin by peeling them. So I like to end, remove the ends, and you can smell it, that it's very nice and ripe. So that means that it is sweet. So remove it, remove all of the peel. Okay, so once we peel our melons, we're going to cut them in half so we can remove the seeds. Okay, so just scoop the seeds out. Okay, and just repeat it to both melons. All right, so once we have our melons all nice and clean, I'm going to be reserving half of one so we can cut into small pieces and now we're, that's what we're going to be using to garnish. And the rest, I'm just going to chop it into smaller pieces so we can transfer it to our blender cup. All right, so once we have our three-fourths of our melons into our blender cup, the other half I'm going to be cutting into small little cubes. Just like that. More like tiny cubes. All right, so once we have our melons all nice and chopped, now we can make our agua fresca. Okay, to a blender cup, we're going to be adding one can of sweetened condensed milk, one tablespoon of Mexican vanilla blend, and we're going to be blending with three cups of water. So not just blending too smooth. Alrighty, so once we have it, we can transfer it to our pitcher. Along with three cups of milk. And one can of evaporated milk. Mix it. And right here you can taste it for sugar and see if it's sweet enough for you. You can place it in your refrigerator and allow it to cool down for about 30 minutes before serving. But just like that, we have our delicious creamy agua de melon. All right, so I like to add the ice when I'm serving, along with my pieces of melon. But of course, you can add the ice to your pitcher, but just like that, we can get ready to serve. And just like that, cheers and enjoy. Alrighty guys, and now for the best part, the taste test. Now let me tell you guys that I hope you give this recipe a try. It's seriously super easy to make and very refreshing. It's perfect for this time of year. Now just make sure that your melons are nice and sweet and you have just the perfect agua fresca. So cheers and enjoy. Mmm. So good, so good. Alrighty guys, and there you have it on how to make a super creamy and refreshing agua de melon. I hope you guys decided to watch this video, and if you did, please don't forget to give me a big thumbs up, share with your friends and family, and if you regret this recipe, please don't forget to tag me in any of my social medias, and if you're new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button so you guys keep part of our family. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye.